Tamara, we've, we've also t talked about how Tamara has, ha uses um, co cooking metaphors a lot and that this is like just a, there's such, there's so few ingredients in this particular soup. And she always talked about it being like a soup, just wanting to feel like a stew. And that Kaylee was dropped in. It was like, first it was like Paul and I, and then Kaylee was dropped in. And so it was like, you can't quite even, she, it's so hard to articulate. Like, she was so perfectly, she came very last minute. Maybe you should tell this story. She was, somebody dropped oh, out of the movie. Oh, yeah. Like three weeks before we were oh, going to shoot. Okay. Um, How because crazy of a scheduling that? thing. And so I thought, like, we were doomed and that... Netflix was gonna pull the plug. We had moved to oh, Netflix wow. from the first studio. Anyway, sure, yeah. there was lots of blah, blah, blah. Um, And then this actress fell out and it really was three weeks. And suddenly we were actressless and um, we started searching and we met with actors that were more recognizable than Kaylee. I had never heard of Kaylee Carter before. Um, and. Uh, but no one was, they were fantastic, but nobody was right, right, correct. I, I remember saying to Jeannie McCarthy, there is, we're in New York, isn't there like a theater actress under a rock? Isn't there like some girl in a basement doing some play that we can find and that will be special? And then um, she emailed me and she said, I found a girl under a rock, but she wasn't <laughs> under a rock. She was in a play in London with Mark Rylance, which is like, oh, as, well. <laughs> not under a rock as you could be. Um, we were worried because she wasn't well known, you know, what Netflix would say. And um, they miraculously said, oh, we think she's great. And we got to cast an unknown person, which is so rare. It was so exciting. Anyway, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. Yeah. It, was, it was so much trust. I mean, it was incredible. And then and I love that she wasn't recognizable. I love that she is some, an, a character that you meet and you have no idea what her significance is because you don't know yeah. who she is, which I always find so great when you go to see films from foreign countries when you don't know sure. the status of the actors. Right. So you'll meet them and you, they could die in, you know, in the next scene or go on for, you know, you don't have an expectation of how important the part's gonna be because of their status as an actor.